<clears throat> Hello, this is Lane Marshall, and I've been a part of EVO for much of its history. I started back in the early 2000s uh, with Vance Stevens uh, bringing me aboard when uh, I had just taken a course, a TESOL course on audio and webcam in online learning. And I got kind of hooked on technology and I found out about EVO and decided to participate and I joined a bunch of sessions and I had a wonderful time. And by 2008, when TESOL came to New York, which is where I am, I decided to run a session on exploring the Big Apple and uh, I moderated for the first time. And then after getting my feet wet as a moderator, uh, I was asked to join the coordination team and I did. It's uh, a wonderful experience to do that and see behind the scenes how this all operates and what a wonderful achievement it is that it's all volunteer and from all over the world. And I've appreciated that opportunity so much. And then after a few years kind of hiatus, I came back to EVO uh, to establish the Flip Learning Group, which I think is now going strong after many years. I uh, started it in 2015. And I just thought it would be a natural for EVO to get into Flip Learning. And uh, then I took another hiatus because uh, I have books I'm writing and other things that I do professionally, but I felt the pull and I missed it. Uh, and so this year I came back. And uh, I started another session, which is uh, SOFLA, the Synchronous Online Flipped Learning Approach. So flipped learning was my baby. So maybe SOFLA is the offspring of flipped learning. And we are now doing flipped learning online with the eight-step cycle of SOFLA. And I've partnered in doing this with two seasoned moderators, Carolina Rodriguez Pitrago and Heike Phil. And in addition to the three of us, I brought in two people, one a student of mine from Long Island University and one a colleague of mine from Long Island, a professional development specialist, Heather Rubin. Uh, so this was a wonderful experience for them. They had not heard of, of EVO. And Kazuko Saito, uh, my student, actually did a SOFLA lesson in Japanese to demonstrate the model, which was phenomenal. And Heather Rubin brought to the group a set of rubrics for SOFLA. And so their presence here as first time moderators has been electrifying. Uh, and while I'm talking about people, I'd just like to say that when I first became a moderator, uh, I had seasoned people mentoring and helping me. And they were Daph Gonzalez and Carla Arena and they were both wonderful. And they got me out of many a tough spot as a new person coming aboard uh, to moderate. And it's been a wonderful experience. And what do I love so much about EVO? Well, it's PD for technology. And I can't say how much I have learned and experimented with in the various sessions over the years, but it's much more than that. Uh, this year, I took the intercultural competence one and the wellness one, and each one of those was such an enriching experience for me, the intercultural one, because that is where my actual research is in culturally responsive teaching, uh, and the wellness one, because this year I felt my wellness going down a little bit because of all the circumstances, and I thought, what better for EVO to give me this wonderful gift? And so both of those sessions were uh, terrific experiences for me, although it's hard to be in sessions and run one at the same time, as many of us know, because so many of us are participants as well as moderators. I'd also like to give a nod to the fact that I made a really good friend out of EVO, uh, Nina Diakos, many of you know her. Uh, I got to know her through EVO and then at TESOL in person. Uh, over the years, and we've become good friends. And I think it's it's a wonderful uh, a wonderful way to meet someone and then develop it online, and then meet them in person, and then become really good friends. So uh, so it's been a it's been a wonderful experience for me over the years. 
And um, I think, it, as I said, it's it's the volunteer spirit that keeps it going and the cognitive surplus, right, Claude Shirky? So we're all sharing what we know with energy and generosity and dedication. And there's nothing better than that, the feeling that you get. And so uh, I just want to celebrate with everyone. And uh, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, short statement video. And I'm so glad we had the opportunity uh, to do the Flipgrid. So thank you very much.